Hello. It's a bit of a rainy day today, but nonetheless, we are back at Mersey Rail. It's been a while. So if you've watched the two videos I've made so far on the topic, I've tried to find what the shortest Mersey Rail journey is, and I think I've pretty conclusively found it now. But there's one thing I haven't done yet, and that is to find the longest journey. Let's go to the other end of the spectrum. So I spent some time earlier trying to find distances between all the different Mersey Rail stations, and I found the three longest in terms of distance. Freshfield to Ainsdale, Hooton to Capenhurst, and Capenhurst to Beach. So those are the three journeys that we're going to do, and we're going to see which is the longest of those. So currently I'm at Freshfield, so let's do Freshfield to Ainsdale. Okay, we're off. First time, here we go. Let's go to Ainsdale. All right, first fresh field to Ainsdale journey. Three minutes and 45 seconds. So yeah, time for journey number two. Three minutes, 48. So let's switch over to the other platform now because I can actually see the other train coming in the distance. So that's three journey times. Cool. So let's go to who? Okay, so we've come to Liverpool Central. So now we'll change to the Wirral line. All right. Off to Hooton. Now we're at Hooton, let's do our first Hooton to Capenhurst timing. Don't know what happened there, I hesitated for a couple of seconds before I pressed start. I no idea why I did that. Anyway, I'll just add them on once we arrive there. Alright, so first trial of Hooton to Capenhurst. Five minutes on the dot. So, longer than Freshfield to Ainsdale by quite a significant margin. So, we'll get the next train back to Hooton now. Almost a whole minute shorter. Maybe it's significantly shorter when it's Capenhurst to Hooton and not the other way round. Who knows? But there's another train right here now, so we'll check that out right now, actually. Oh. Unfortunately, though, the trains seem to have other plans. Okay, so I'm at Beach now because I didn't realise that the train I was on was a semi-fast that skipped Capenhurst. <laughs> so... Uh, yeah, it's taken me all the way to Beach, so I need to go all the way back to Hooton. One second. And we're back at Hooton. Okay. Take two. Okay, so for real this time, this train does actually stop at Capenhurst. So we get the final time for Capenhurst, and then we'll stay on the same train. We'll go immediately to Beach and get the time for Capenhurst to Beach. And then we'll do two more of those, and then we're done. We'll have all the data we need. 
Okay, so that Hooton's Cape House time was 4.21. I can't actually show you because my well, time's ticking on the watch already for Cape House today. Um, but yeah, so it was 4.21 and now we'll do first Cape House to Bates journey. So 4.39, very nice. So that's the first Cape to Bates journey. So let's go back and then come back once more. And then we're done. However, once again, problems arose. This train's a semi-fast to Hooten. Ugh. For the sake of my own sanity, I'm just gonna do another Capenhurst to Beach timing as my second one, and then we'll do Beach to Capenhurst if the next one back here also does that, so. Yeah, hope you don't mind, but I'm going to do that for my own sanity. <laughs> Four forty-nine. So, last one back. The next train back doesn't call at Cape and Hurst again. So I need to go back to Hooten again. Fun, fun. Okay, and finally, finally, we can get the last Cape and Hurst Beach journey in. Hooray! And there we have it, our final time of 4 minutes 45. So without further ado, here are all the times we collected. And if we average out all the times, we can conclude that Capenhurst to Beach takes the crown as the longest Merseyrail journey. Very nice. So there we have it, the other end of the spectrum, the longest Merseyrail journey. So thank you for watching this video, if you enjoyed it, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, you know, whatever, whatever you do on YouTube nowadays. But yeah. Hope you enjoyed, thank you for watching, I'll see you next time, goodbye.